Ironclad differences, unveiling the secrets of plant versus animal iron sources. Today we're gonna to dive deep into the world of iron rich food. So get ready to iron out those nutrient deficiencies, my friends. Now, we all know the importance of iron for our body. It's like a superhero in our bloodstream, fighting off fatigue and keeping us energized. But did you know not all iron is created equal? True. Meet our first contenders, heme iron and non-heme iron. Red meat, my carnivorous pals, contains heme iron, while veggies primarily provide us with non-heme iron. Heme iron is like the king of the iron kingdom. It's found in red meat, like juicy steaks, sizzling hamburgers, and mouth-watering bacon. Oh, so good. Oh. Non-heme iron, on the other hand, acts as the humble sidekick. It's found in various plant-based foods like spinach, lentils, and chickpeas. And now, my friends, we face the battle of bioavailability. Heme iron gets readily absorbed by our bodacious body, whereas non-heme iron struggles with it and needs some backup dancers to help it become more bioavailable. Enter the cast iron skillet. Now, it's no ordinary pan. When cooking in cast iron, a tiny amount of iron leaches into our food. This little boost can help increase our iron intake. So, start sizzling these iron-rich foods in a cast iron skillet. It's time for a tasty iron-boosting fiesta in our tummy. And there you have it, my dear viewers. The best sources of iron are heme iron from red meat and non-heme iron from vegetables. Although non-heme iron may not be easily absorbed, cooking in a cast iron skillet can give it a helping hand. Well, it's time for me to iron on out of here. Remember, Stay iron strong and let's cook up some laughter together again soon. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more fun facts.